Of all of the instruments in NASA's Earth observing system, MODIS has proven to be one of the most versatile, producing both groundbreaking science and compelling images. The moderate resolution imaging spectroradiometer on both the Aqua and Terra satellites has changed the way we look at our atmosphere, oceans, and land. MODIS increased the wavelength range, covered more physical properties of the environment that it could monitor. It measured them down as small as 250 meters, size of a, a couple, couple football fields in size, and had many more spectral bands to study more aspects of the ocean biology, of the land, fires, and it was a very technological advance in capabilities. And for a long time in the EOS community, it was referred to as the quintessential instrument of the OS because it did more things for more people, more disciplines than any other single instrument. The study of clouds is, not surprisingly, incredibly important for understanding weather and climate. And until MODIS came along, it was commonly accepted that at any given time, the Earth was about 50% covered by clouds. But data from the instrument showed that cloud cover was actually closer to 70%. MODIS can also measure the temperature and height of clouds and differentiate between clouds composed of liquid water and those made of ice. MODIS also monitors the world's oceans, measuring sea surface temperature, ocean color and clarity, and the basis of the marine food chain, phytoplankton. MODIS has done a very good job of getting uh, this biological signature, so chlorophyll A which follows phytoplankton and ocean currents, and you can see the, uh, the seasonal variation due to El Nino and other things where the biological productivity of the ocean. This is important because the, this biological photosynthesis takes carbon dioxide out, produces oxygen as part of photosynthesis, and so it is a sink for carbon that we, man, put in the atmosphere. MODIS also looks at the land, monitoring fires, land use change, and various measures of the Earth's plant life. So it's been used for a long time to monitor the growth of vegetation, the seasonal cycle, and then how that changes year to year, whether it's due to droughts associated with El Nino or spread of the Sahara, but it's a very good index to monitor. The versatility of MODIS, as it measures land, sea, and air, contributes to the wealth of information being revealed by the Aqua mission.